There is a critical insight, a foundational idea that we learn about what Jewish destiny and Jewish life is all about in the beginning of this week's Parsha. We know that the enterprise of the unity of the Jewish people was almost over before it began. The brothers are prepared to give up on each other, to create discord for generations. How is it that the brothers led by Yehuda were prepared to do the most horrific thing, to sell Joseph, Mechirat Yosef, a sin according to the sages that we still suffer from, from today, give up on him and sell him down to Egypt for dead. And in return, we see in this week's Pasha, Yosef is prepared to do the same with the brothers. He's, or, he's orchestrated that Benjamin will remain with him in Egypt. And he's about to send the brothers back forever to their father to remain, perhaps with his brother from the same mother, Rachel. The children of Rachel perhaps will be the new Jewish people, the new Bnei Israel, and not the children of Leah. And then Yehuda does an incredible thing, which brings to life and to existence the birth of a new idea. He says, no. He says, Avdecha aravetanar. He says, Joseph, no, I will sit in his place. Benjamin has to go back to his father because I made a pledge, personal responsibility. I said to my father, Anuchi erveno. The condition of bringing my brother Benjamin is that I took full and personal responsibility and therefore I am prepared to sit in prison to the end of days to rot in Egyptian prison, but that my brother Benjamin should go back. Wow, what a tikkun, what a balchuva, what a rectification. The same one who is prepared to give up in Joseph Yehuda is the same one who is prepared now not to give up at all in Benjamin, to send Benjamin back and him to pay the ultimate price. In fact, the Gemara at the end of Masechet Bab Metzir, Dav Kuf Ein Gimel 173 learns the principle here of called Arvud Kablan, full and personal responsibility. This wasn't third party insurance, this wasn't a regular guarantor. This was a person who took full personal responsibility, that he will pay the price, he will repay the debt forever in order that his brother can go back. And here perhaps were born the Jewish people, called after Yehuda, as we'll see next week's parasha, Ta Yuducha Achecha, Chazal say we are all called Yehudim, perhaps because of the Arvut Hadadit, the fact that the brothers in the end were not prepared to give up on each other and take full personal responsibility. We face so many challenges and unfortunately so often Jews are prepared to give up on each other. This one's out of the fold, that one's out of the fold. This one ideologically doesn't fit in and that one doesn't. The lesson of the brothers is to come full circle. We are part of one family. So few of us, 13, 14 million today, not to give up on any Jew, not to give up on any part of the Jewish people. Because ultimately in our sense of full and personal responsibility is the secret of success of the Jewish people. Shabbat Shalom.